Welcome back and welcome to another Enchanted Fandom Drinking Vessel unboxing video. Today I will be unboxing the March Enchanted Fandom Drinking Vessel box and making the cocktail as always. So I will leave my discount code for Enchanted Fandom website in the uh, description box below so you can save 10%. You cannot save 10% unfortunately on the drinking vessel boxes, but if you want to order a regular subscription box, you can use that discount code for that. This is the March drinking vessel. I know it's a bit late, but mine went missing. Um, I blame my neighbor in apartment 319, but you know, he says he doesn't have it. Who knows? Um, so yes, very excited to have this. I have been slightly spoiled for it, but obviously I haven't seen this in person. So I have slit the top and we're ready to unbox and see what it is. So as always, the first thing you get in your Enchanted Fandom Drinking Vessel box is a beautiful, beautiful recipe card. And this one is just such a gorgeous shade of pink. And this one has Crescent City Tea, which is the non-alcoholic cocktail and also a Crescent City cocktail, which is the alcoholic cocktail. And this one has strawberries, ginger beer, vodka, simple syrup, lime juice, and mint. And so it's basically like a long vodka, but with strawberry. And then the Crescent City tea has uh, hibiscus tea, honey, ice, sparkling water, mint, and strawberries also. So if you had the ingredients for one of them, you could also make the other one if you had your hibiscus tea to hand. Um, so that is the beautiful, beautiful recipe card. And then let's see what we have in the box aside from crinkle, crinkly brown paper. Oh, it is well packaged. That is the thing with Enchanted Fandoms. They always package their things extremely well. I have ordered other glassware from them and mugs from them in the past and they're always packaged so well, even if the box looks slightly bashed. The thing inside will be safe. And you can always bet that you'll find some crinkles on the floor after filming the video. And of course, it's hand wash only. Don't soak, don't microwave, hand wash only. Let's just see what is inside. So well packaged. Oh, it's like, it's like opening a present on Christmas Day. Here we have the Crescent City wine glass. Now, I have not read Crescent City and I have no intention of reading Crescent City, but I am the biggest fan of Enchanted Fandom glitter wine glasses. And I think Jess said that they used four, three or four different colours of glitter to create this gorgeous effect on here. It's so sparkly and so gorgeous. I love it. And like, even if you weren't a Crescent City fan, I mean, it's got a C on it. It's basically, it's a Katrina wine glass. I love it. Uh, <laughs> there's a thumbnail right there. Um, so, having looked at the ingredients of today's cocktail, I have one of them, just the one, and that's vodka. Um, so, we're going to improvise. Normally, I would go and make the cocktail, however, I'm not about to go and make a trip out when I shouldn't be going out just to go and get these things. So we're going to improvise. I have, I'm not going to just drink straight vodka. I have my bottle of Prosecco here. So we're still going to use the glass as it is intended to be used. I have my Costco brand Prosecco and we're going to christen the glass. And it's going to look beautiful with the shimmery, shiny glitter. Like who needs those like rose gold add-ins for your Prosecco when you've got a gorgeous sparkle wine glass. And of course the key part of the cocktail making experience is the tasting. So there's the wine glass in action and let's taste it. And I'll let you know how it tastes. 
I can confirm that the Prosecco tastes better out of this glitter wine glass. I endorse this glass as a good glass for wine. Um, so I hope you don't mind missing out on the cocktail making this month, but if at some point I happen to come into possession of strawberries or ginger beer or hibiscus tea bags, I will make it on another platform and share it with you. Um, but this is March's gorgeous, beautiful, I'm so taken with it, honestly, uh, Crescent City Glitter Wine Glass. You know you want to see more of that glitter, that sparkle, 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 sparkle. It's just beautiful. As I say, discount code if you want to buy any of their other glitter wine glasses in their um, shop is in the description box. Or if you want to order April's um, subscription box, their full box, which I do have a couple of those unboxings um, on this channel, they're always amazing and so packed with stuff. I think they're like the best value for money. Um, or link to their website if you want to subscribe and get these gorgeous drinking vessels every month. It's so exciting when my box shows up in the mail. So exciting. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know in uh, the comments what cocktail you would put in this glass or if you would just be like me and put Prosecco in it. Um, I'll be back with another video very soon, so make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss that, and I will see you then. Thanks for watching. Bye.